So, uh, good afternoon, uh, everybody. Thank you very much uh, for being here today. Uh, well, uh, in the coming few minutes, Christine and I we would like to share uh, uh, would like to share with you some relevant information uh, concerning clean tech in Germany, opportunities and support. Looking to our greenhouse gas emission reduction targets, um, we have to emphasize that according to the Paris Agreement and along uh, and within the scope of the German Climate Plan 2050, Germany um, has uh, set out um, different targets of targets for different uh, sectors in Germany. So in former times we had we we were focused on on the energy sector, but nowadays, after the Paris uh, uh, Agreement, uh, we have now um, targets for the energy sector, building sector. Uh, transport sector, industry and agriculture, and they have some others. But um, today I would like to focus on uh, the targets uh, for the building sector. So, but before I'd like to, to uh, highlight, uh, it's a pretty uh, noun story, as you know, uh, how we achieve it until today our targets uh, within the scope of our energy transition. So we increased indeed uh, the renewable share in, tota in the total energy consumption, but uh, we still have to reduce our primary uh, energy consumption and increase efficiency. So in the next minutes I will focus on the targets for um, efficiency in buildings. So if, if you uh, look into this graphic here, you see that for 2020, we have uh, a reduction of a final energy, energy consumption in buildings uh, by 20% uh, based on 2008 levels. So it's, uh, I would say it's uh, uh, a very ambitious goal, but uh, we have to, to fulfill uh, and to achieve these goals because three quarters of the buildings in Germany uh, were built before 1980. So renovation of existing stock is key to meeting energy efficiency targets. So the good news are that we have uh, really very generous incentives in Germany, like for example the KFW, Efi energy efficient construction program incentive um, and that kind of incent incentives are supporting uh, you uh, if you are constructing new buildings in Germany or if you are refurbishing uh, new buildings in Germany. You see the um, numbers for 2016. 50% uh, of the new residential uh, buildings in Germany, they received uh, that kind of incentives coming from the KFW, Energy Efficient Construction Program. Just pay attention here to the fact that we have in Germany, on the one hand, the so-called market pool incentives programs, uh, like, uh, for example, that kind of incentives here, um, and these incentives are for households, municipalities or enterprises interested in implementing um, energy efficient technologies in Germany. On the other hand, we have also other incentives like, for example, cash grants for companies interested in manufacturing energy efficient technologies in Germany. And note that buildings consume, are consuming still 40% of energy in Germany. Manetos has mentioned this also before. In private and in private households, 85% 85, 85 of energy is used for heating and hot water. And this figure here show us that nearly only a third that, uh, that, that nearly uh, one third of German residential heating system systems burn oil. However, we can see on the bottom uh, that uh, uh, a slight and continuous green line is uh, coming up. This is the 
uh, heat uh, pump market. So we hope that uh, this uh, green line continues to grow, then upgrading uh, existing heating systems is key to meeting energy efficiency targets in, targets in Germany, then 67% um, of the existing sy uh, systems are considered as not efficient. And also here, there is a wide range of incentive programs related to heating systems, and I would say there is no better time to approach this attractive and very exciting market in Germany. And the good news is that we can support you, and Christina will tell you how we will do this. Thank you very much. Thank you, Florida, for giving the, us these uh, interesting numbers on the German cleantech market. And Jan, thank you for bringing me to Stockholm. I'm thankful for this. <laughs> so, who are we? Germany Trade and Invest. Um, yeah, please let me introduce our organization. Uh, Germany Trade and Invest, or GTAI, is the official German foreign trade and investment agency. We promote Germany as a business and technology location worldwide. But we also provide investment consultancy services for foreign companies that are looking into the German market. I hope we have someone here that might be interested coming to Germany with their innovative products and solutions. So what do we do? More specifically, we provide our services, which also are free of charge, by the way. Um, we provide comprehensive industry analysis, where we also identify different ongoing business opportunities in Germany. We can assist with product management support, where we support your company in finding the best market entry strategy for Germany and also finding a good location within the country. Moreover, we can offer you information about tax and legal framework, financing and incentives um, schemes, data in general, and we do have quite a good network which your company definitely can profit from. So in practice, we help you to understand what's the procedure of setting up a company in Germany, how does it work. Tax-wise, we can actually tell you that there are local variations of the tax burden for a company, depending on where you have your seating within the country, but we can also help you in, in finding the more attractive locations throughout Germany. We give you an overall picture of what kind of incentives are available. We have a, a broad, um, broad uh, many programs for different kind of incentives. Florida mentioned some of them, but there are also, of course, industry-specific or maybe even also R&D-related incentives. And we can also provide you with different contacts from German banks or other financial institutions. So, um, we are very happy to meet you here at EcoSummit and we would love to talk more directly with you and your company who, how you actually could profit from the German clean tech market. So, please do not hesitate to talk with us later on. Thanks so much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.